Hey guys! So I was just going through my average business the other day. You know, I was eating cereal as you do, when suddenly I bit my tongue. I don't know why I did it. Maybe my tongue just got in the way or maybe it seemed like a fun activity. I don't know. But what I can tell you is it hurt like nobody's business. And suddenly it occurred to me that some things in this world hurt more than they should. Like, way more. Now this got the wheels in my head turning. What other things hurt more than they should? And this is what I came up with. Stubbing your toe. Not only does it hurt at first, but when it happens, you take it as a challenge. Rather than just sitting down and waiting out the pain, you decide that you are going to turn the world into an obstacle course and do exactly what you were going to do before, but on one foot. Hitting your funny bone. This one's actually really weird because you just hit your elbow, but you feel it in the entirety of your arm. And people just laugh at you. But maybe that's why it's called a funny bone, because it's funny for everyone else. But I can tell you that it is most definitely not funny for whoever it's happening to. Drinking something down the wrong pipe. This one just makes you look like a complete spaz, because you're basically choking on water. And I can't tell you how many times this has happened to me. Blah, 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 science, blah, 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 equation, blah, 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 earth, blah, 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 hypothesis, blah, 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 photosynthesis, blah, 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 science, blah, blah, happy, stop being such a distraction. Paper cuts. Those little buggers are the bane of my existence. I mean, you're just doing your day-to-day -day stuff, minding your own business, and suddenly it's like the homework that you are doing is trying to revolt against you. I don't even get how they work. I mean, paper isn't even sharp. A butter knife is sharper, yet I manage to maneuver one of those without cutting myself. Hitting your head on a table or an open cabinet. This one usually goes one of two ways. God, what? I don't even remember opening that. What? Or it goes a little something like this. Be careful when you get up, honey. Will mom. Okay, let's see this here. I told you so. And let me tell you, neither way is too much fun. They do, however, both give you a massive headache. Turf burn. As a soccer player of 10 years, this is something that I have quite a bit of experience about. Let me explain this with some math. Playing on turf three days a week, plus having the balance of a three-year-old on a unicycle, plus a contact sport, equals lots and lots of turf burn. For someone who doesn't play soccer, this is a lot like a rug burn. But let me tell you, that stuff hurts when it's on its own. But once you start getting turf burn on top of your turf burn, you begin to have the urge to chop your leg off. Accidentally stabbing yourself with a pencil. I don't know if anyone else has to deal with this one, but I've been suffering from it my whole life. I probably have 10 different dots on my hands from when I poked myself. Not to mention the one time when I managed to poke myself with a pencil in the eye. Yup. Well done, Abby. Mm. I actually think I still have the mark from that one. Can you see it? And the piece de resistance, stepping on a Lego. This one I had to deal with a lot growing up, seeing as I have an older brother who doesn't get the concept of cleaning up after yourself. So there I am, waddling around with my little dolly, because as you can see, I was a very stereotypical little girl. When the world began to go in slow motion, before I could stop it, BAM! The Lego was lodged into my foot. Oh god, I'm shivering just thinking about it. 
And nothing can surpass that moment of F me than when you see your foot going towards that little colorful plastic bullet of pain and misfortune and you know there is nothing you can do to stop it. So that's it for this video guys. This probably wasn't nearly as relevant for most of you as it is for me because I'm literally the clumsiest person on the world. Like I actually get hurt in my sleep. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to comment and subscribe down below. I'll be your best friend if you do. Until next time, keep it nerdy. Bye!